Hello friends, welcome back to my YouTube channel Unlock Your Learning. In this video, we are going to solve ICC Mathematics Class 8 Chapter 25 Area of Rectilinear Figures Exercise 25 A Question 10. This is an open tank is 3 meters long, 2 meters wide and 1 meters 50 centimeters deep. Find the amount of paint required to paint its side inside and outside if 1 kilogram of paint covers 20 square meters. So there is an open tank. Open tank means what? You have seen tanks that are in shape of cuboids. So the open tank is the tank that is not having the ceiling, the top, the roof of that. It is missing. So what we have? Four sides. You can take example of the room in which you are sitting. One, two, three, four. Four sides and one floor. So total how many sides? Five sides in this open tank. Now it is saying it is three meters long, two meters wide, one meters fifty centimeters deep. We have studied 3D shapes. What it's given in the 3D shapes? They have three dimensions, length, breadth and height. So length is 3 meters, breadth that is 2 meters. Your uh, height is 1 meter 50 centimeters in case of the cuboids, right? And now you can see that we have to paint inside of this tank and outside. Inside means all five sides will be painted. And outside means all the five sides from the outside also will be painted. Suppose if I will, if I have to paint this marker, so I will put paint outside of this. And if I have to paint it inside, then I will open the cap and then put the paint inside it. That is what we are doing in this tank also. So what I will do is I will calculate the area of the tank, the entire area, right? Since my tank has how many sides? I, I said before, it has five sides. You can see, take example of your room, one in front of you, one behind you, one to the right, one to the left. So four, this and one floor. Since it's an open tank, so ceiling is not there. So five sides, what will their area be? See, first for breadth and height. Breadth into height. Now, these two sides are opposite to each other, but same in length, right? So what I will do? multiply it by 2 because there are two such sides breadth into height breadth into height will give me area only for one side but there are two sides so we'll multiply that by 2 and now length into height by length into height to get the area of the other two walls that are there right so length into height and since two walls are there so multiply this by 2 and then there will be floor also that has to be painted so for the floor what i will do i will do length into breadth simple Floor is a rectangle, so nothing much, just length into breadth. And only one side is there, that's why just breadth into uh, length into breadth. Now, put the values, we have 2 into C. My breadth is 2 meters, height is 1.5. This, you can see 1 meter 50 centimeters, that's 1.5 meters. And then plus 2 into length is 3 into height, again 1.5. Plus length into breadth, so length is... 3 into 2 breadth that is 6 so now now just calculate this see 2 into 2 4 4 into 1.5 that's your 6.0 plus 2 into 3 6 into 1.5 that's your 9.0 plus 3 into 2 that's my 6 so we have 6 plus 9 plus 6 so that's your 20 one square centimeters this is the area of the tank but remember this area is only for the inside we also have to paint the outsides of this tank for that what i will do area of inside and outside combined so what will that be 21 is the area of the tank inside same area will be there outside also area will not change so what i will do 21 into 2 that's what 42 square centimeters that's the area of the tank from the inside and the outside combined now it is saying that how much paint is required if 1 kg can cover 20 square meters so paint required you can mention it here paint required how much will be required so this is the total area that has to be painted 42 square centimeters and 1 kg of paint covers how much 20 square meters so 42 upon 20 
This will give me how much paint is required to cover 42 square centimeters. Solve this, right? Uh, so what you will have here 10, here you will have 21. So this is 2.1, decimal point moves to 1 place 2.1 and put the unit kgs. This much paint is required to uh, paint the tank from inside and the outside. And friends, this is all for today. If you are new to my YouTube channel, do not forget to subscribe and leave a like on this one. Till then, take good care of yourselves and bye-bye.